Hi, hello, welcome back. My name is Devraj. Today I want to look at the idea of hypersensitivity because there are a lot of people around who often experience life as everything is kind of invasive. You know, everything is coming towards them too much and they feel like, you know, they can't cope. They feel like, you know, that in order to get through the day, they need to keep away from certain people, they need to keep away from certain situations and to somehow preserve a safe space within them where they can feel okay and be functional. And this is really happening because there's a some, some, and this is really happening because there's a kind of imbalance between the energy in their heart and the energy in their base. In simple terms, they've got too much opening here and not enough opening lower down around the base, around the perineum, the base of your body. And and this is and, and so it creates this situation where everything feels slightly invasive. And unless the people around you are incredibly soft and gentle, it's really hard to just cope with life. Now, of course, sensitivity is really useful and there are a lot of people in the world who need to have a great deal more of it. But it's not useful to have so much sensitivity and so little opening here, but it just feels overwhelming. So today I'm going to look at an exercise you can do to open up more lower down here around your base, get more grounding going, feel like you're connected to the earth and that you don't have to protect yourself so much in your environment. So take your feet wide apart, like wider than shoulder width, and try to have the outsides of your feet roughly parallel and then bend your knees so you can drop your ass and you've got a bit of kind of flexibility here. And then what we're going to do is, relatively up but with a knee slightly bent, we make a grunting sound, which is basically just a distinct sound and that's the lowest sound you can make. You know, it's not a kind of chanting thing, it's a very animal atavistic kind of sound. And at the same time you just drop your ass, like, a, like a not, not really controlling it and you keep your back bone upright, it looks, and, and your arms relaxed, it looks like this. <coughs> What's important is to keep the sound just low, and like a guttural grunt. And have quite an ugly look on your face. Don't control the, your movement down, you don't need to jump up and down, but just <coughs> And as you do it, feel into this whole area here. Keep your backbone, don't lean forwards. It's easy to lean forwards in this posture. You want to keep it so you're a bit like a kind of pile driver from, from the knees, basically. So it's like <sighs> If you're a fan of my style of bioenergetics, you'll know that we often do similar exercises working with the pelvis, a right to exist exercise or teenager release, hurling the shoulders down. But this is a distinctly different thing. We're really focusing on opening here at the base. I recommend that you do it for two, three, four minutes at a time and then just have a bit of a break, relax and feel your body lying down or sitting down. Let's just have one final look at it because it's quite good fun to do. So arms relaxed, backbone straight, eyes open. <sighs> grunt I can feel becoming more connected with the earth okay give it a try thank you for tuning in and I'll speak to you soon